Jude Bellingham blasts Trent Alexander-Arnold critics after England's victory over Serbia, as he hails the Liverpool star's performance in midfield and claims, people talk a lot of rubbish. Jude Bellingham has leapt to the defence of Trent Alexander-Arnold after England's win over Serbia on Sunday. The three Lions edged out Dragan Stojkovic's side 1-0 in their Euro 2024 opener in Gelsenkirchen, with Bellingham scoring the decisive goal after just 13 minutes. Gareth Southgate deployed Alexander-Arnold in centre midfield alongside Declan Rice for the clash, with this an idea the England boss has been working on over the past year. The Red Star, who usually plays at right back, initially impressed and looked bright alongside several of his teammates in the first half. However, Alexander-Arnold faded as the game went on and was exposed on a few occasions, while he was also guilty of surrendering possession in dangerous areas. He was ultimately replaced by Conor Gallagher in the 69th minute as England aimed to shore up the midfield and hold on to their lead. But Bellingham, who was the three Lions star man on the night, hit back at the critics and insisted Alexander-Arnold's display had been underappreciated. He makes it so easy for me because he can control the game so well defensively in that position, Bellingham told ITV Sport. I know people talk a lot of rubbish but he's so aggressive with that back-to-goal pressure and it really helped me as well because it meant I got a breather when he went out. I think we understand each other well with the ball, he wants to play positive all the time, he wants to play forward all the time. The Real Madrid star went on to hail Alexander-Arnold's ability and felt the 26 cap star brought something different to the side. He added, We accept as teammates who have that kind of quality that we are going to lose the ball and that's fine. We will win it back for each other and we will keep playing. I thought he was brilliant. England's victory put them straight to the top of Group C after Denmark and Slovenia drew 1-1 earlier on Sunday. The three Lions return to action on Thursday when they take on the Danes, before Southgate's side face Slovenia the following Tuesday.